Danny. Welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy because it is finally September and that means that it's officially fall and I'm so excited because I love the fall time. I love the fall fashion, the fall makeup. I love that pumpkin spice lattes are back. Literally pumpkin spice everything is back and I'm so excited. I'm obsessed with it. I'm loving it and it's just a beautiful thing. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my top five fall must-haves and I'm just going to jump right in and get started. So my number one absolute fall must-have that I think everybody needs to get into that fall spirit are fall scented candles and these are both from Bath & Body Works. I always get my candles from there because they have the best scents and they just last really long. So the first one that I got is Sweater Weather and this one's really cute. I love the picture on it. It has a bunch of leaves and trees on it and the cover of the candle is really pretty. It has um, leaves designed on it and it's really nice. And the scent of this candle reminds me of two Bath & Body Works candles combined together. If you guys know the candle Fresh Balsam aka the Christmas tree scent or leaves and I'm sure everybody knows about leaves because that one is like raved about all the time on YouTube. Um, this candle literally smells like leaves and fresh balsam combined. It smells, it smells so good. This literally smells like if you're walking outside on a nice fall day, I feel like this is what the air would smell like. It smells so good. It just smells like a Christmas tree mixed with cinnamon goodness and I highly recommend it. It smells so good and if you're looking for a fall candle I would highly recommend Sweater Weather. And the next candle that I picked up is Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin and this one is in a cute little mason jar and I saw it sitting there and I had to get it. I feel like anything that's in a mason jar is just so cute and I just I had to get it. And this one smells like cinnamon mixed with pumpkin pie and to me, that just screams fall. If you light this candle, you will literally have fall vibes in your room. I mean, you can't go wrong with a pumpkin pie scented candle for the fall. Am I right? So moving on, my next fall must-have has to be dark nail polishes. So the first one that I have is from OPI, and this one's in the shade Linkin Park After Dark. And this one is a dark purple, and on me, since I'm super pale, it looks black, but in the light you can see that it is a dark purple, and I love this shade. Another fall nail polish shade that I would recommend is from Essie, and this one is in the shade Shearling Darling, and it's what I have on my nails right now, and this one is a dark maroon shade, and I literally love both of these nail polishes. Anytime that I've been wearing a dark nail polish on my channel, even in my old videos, it's been one of these. Um, these two are just my go-to fall nail polishes. If I'm feeling a little bit more darker, in a darker mood, um, I would wear this one. And if I'm feeling just a little bit lighter but still darker, um, then I would wear the darker maroon. Both of these I highly recommend. They're amazing. Even when it's not fall, I'll always gravitate towards these if I want a darker nail polish. Um, so if you guys are looking for some fall nail polish shades, then I recommend you checking out these ones. They're my favorite. So for my next fall must-have, I'm sure a lot of you guys already guessed it, it's a vampy lip color and you cannot be set for fall without a good fall lip color and I'm going to be sharing with you guys two of my favorites because you need a good vampy lip color to rock in all your fall selfies. So the first one that I would recommend is from Kat Von D. This one is a liquid lipstick and it's in the shade Vampira. It's this really pretty dark maroon shade. And I'm actually wearing Vampira on my lips right now. And what's good about this lip color is that it's a liquid lipstick, which means it's going to go on like a liquid, but in seconds it's going to dry matte, which is so good because you want your lips to stay on while you're eating or while you're drinking your pumpkin spice latte. So that's always a good thing and you can buy this lip stain at Sephora. The next fall lip color that I would recommend is actually a drugstore lip product which is good because it's really affordable and this one is from Revlon and it's in the shade Black Cherry and I used this in my fall tutorial last year so if you want to see what this looks like on the lips then go ahead and check out that video. So this one's the swatch of Black Cherry and as you can see it's a lot shinier and I don't really like the shine so what I'll do is take a little bit of powder and just 
press it on the center of my lips and blend it in and it will instantly make this lipstick matte which is a good little trick to use if you don't like that shine um, and also I would definitely recommend using a lip liner with this lipstick um, one that I love using is Max Night Moth and in my fall tutorial from last year I did use Max Night Moth with this lipstick and I think it looks gorgeous another one of my fall must-haves is definitely knit sweaters I'm wearing one right now and this one is maroon which is definitely a fall color I love wearing maroon during the fall and this one is from Brandy Melville I love it it's off the shoulder and it's oversized and it's really cozy this one is one of my favorites I love this camel color and this knit sweater is from Urban Outfitters and I love the elbow detailing it has these patches on the elbow that I think is really cute and this one is also oversized on me so I can get away with wearing it as a sweater dress and I love wearing sweater dresses with tights and then layering with knee-high socks or thigh-high socks I just think it's so cute and that's one of my favorite things about fall is layering so I would definitely say chunky knit sweaters are one of my fashion fall must-haves so my last and final fall must-have is knee-high socks and I'm obsessed with wearing these during the fall time. I think knee-high socks are my number one fall fashion must-have because they just literally put your whole outfit together and I have three pairs to show you guys. Um, so the first pair is this gray pair and these ones are from H&M and I think they were like $10. They came in a pack. I also have a pair of hunter green ones that came with it but I think those are in the wash right now so the second pair that I have are from Urban Outfitters and these ones are all knit which I really like and it's an oatmeal -y shade and the top of them have these ruffled detailings and I think it's so cute and these ones I think are cute to like lounge around the house and wear like an oversized flannel and I think it would just be so warm and cozy and the last pair that I have to show you guys are these black ones and these ones are just really basic the black ones just go with anything and it's really easy to pair with it um, like I would wear this with my outfit right now so I would definitely recommend getting a black pair if you guys are interested in wearing knee-high socks I would definitely recommend starting off with a black pair first these ones are from American Apparel and I'm just obsessed with knee-high socks for the fall time and I also have black thigh high socks from American Apparel which I love so I definitely think knee high socks or thigh high socks are definitely a fall fashion must have at least for me I'm obsessed with them and they're something that I need to have during the fall time because they just they're amazing that's what's fun about fall fashion like they literally just make dressing up so much fun they make your outfit look a lot cuter and edgier and I'm obsessed with it I love fall fashion love fall makeup so those are my top five fall must-haves and I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video I hope it inspired you guys and got you guys excited and ready for the fall time and let me know what your fall must-have is down below in the comments and if you guys would like to see a fall fashion lookbook, then give this video a big thumbs up because I love filming lookbooks for you guys. And thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye!